Hey guys, today I just wanted to do a haul. Um, I have some items that I got from a Makeup Alley swap. Well, actually two swaps. They're kind of pieces of swaps. And um, stuff that I got from Books A Million, Sally's, um, Dillard's, a friend, Claire's, a grocery store. I think that's about it. I'm just trying to make sure I didn't miss anything. So first of all, um, these following items are from a swap. I got a L'Octane Sweet Sugar Scrub that's the honey and lemon. And it smells really good. I haven't tried it yet, um, but I love this brand. I never know how to say it, but I love their stuff. So I'm excited about using this. Um, I also got a Cora's Shower Gel in Honey Spice, which smells amazing. I love Cora's Shower Gels. I got a little sample of Aqualina Pink Sugar, which I also love, and a sample of Sarah Jessica Parker and Covet. I haven't smelled this yet, but I've been wanting to try it out. Um, I also got a Stella Lip Glaze in Gumdrop. And uh, L'Oreal Hip Pigment in Fiery, which is just a shimmery pink. And last but not least, a Caldrea Dish Liquid Soap in Ginger Palmello. I love this brand, and someone just added this in our swap as an extra, um, which was really sweet. So if you ever see this brand, Caldrea, um, you should try some of their stuff. I've tried their hand soap and their dish soap and their linen spray and I love all of their products and all of their scents smell amazing too so it's really hard just to decide on like one scent so um, if you ever see that out you should definitely try it I recommend it and their stuff is pretty fairly priced so um, I went to Books A Million um, on a study break and I saw this book which is Chelsea Handler's My Horizontal Life um, this is just kind of like a it's not really an autobiography, but it's a book she wrote supposedly about her collection of one-night stands. Um, and I've only gotten through like the first two, two chapters because I started reading it in the bookstore. Chelsea Handler is hilarious. This isn't for like the faint of heart because she's a little um, uncensored, I guess you could say. <laughs> but I mean, I guess that's pretty self-explanatory in the title. Um, I listened to her book... Are You There Vodka? It's Me Chelsea on audio tape um, online because I had this like coupon for um, an audio book and I loved it um, so I just thought I would buy this. It's a really easy reader so far so um, if you want I'll let you know what I think of it once I finish. So also I went to Sally's and I've been seeing a lot of people talk about this Batiste dry shampoo um, this was $7.29, so I got this. They didn't have the tropical scent. They just had the original and the blush. And um, another girl on YouTube, I can't remember her name, but she had said that the blush was too strong. <clears throat> Excuse me, of a smell. So I figured I'd just get the original. Um, you can see my review on the Ojon dry hair shampoo or dry shampoo or whatever it's called. Um, and I bought that like maybe four times now. I love that, but I figured, um, I think those cans are like four ounces or something, and it's $24 at Sephora. This is 5.5 ounces and like $7.29, plus you don't have to pay shipping or anything. So I'm always trying to find like ways to save money and find like, you know, lower end items to replace like stuff from Sephora or Nordstrom or whatever. So yeah, I'm going to try this out. Let me know if you want to hear what I think about it. Hopefully it's a dupe for the Ojon. I'm really hoping. Um, but if not, the Ojon is wonderful. So it's definitely worth the $24. Next, I got, um, this was from the grocery store. Sorry, I'm kind of going out of order. Um, in the organic aisle, Aurora... Kasha, I don't know, Pure Aromatherapy Mineral Bath in Lavender Harvest. It's just a packet, and I guess you put the whole thing in, 
um, in your bath. So, I don't know. It looked cool. So I'll try this. I think it was like $2.50, which is kind of expensive for one bath, but I don't know. It looked interesting. I found this Alba Terra Gloss. Um, I've tried their chapsticks before and they were really nice. They're kind of like tropical scented. This is just like a shimmering lip gloss and Dawn is the color. And I have it on right now, but I have like a hot pink lip color underneath. So this color is like really shimmery. Um, I definitely wouldn't wear it alone, but it smells good and it's not sticky at all. It's a really good lip gloss. I think this was like around five bucks, give or take two bucks. So um, I definitely recommend this and it smells good and it's really moisturizing. So, and I think it's organic. I don't know. It was in the organic section, so yeah, I don't know. And then I've been dying to try the Burt's Bees Radiance Lip Shimmer. Um, I've tried the Guava and the Champagne. The Guava Lip Shimmer is really shimmery, kind of like this, but like pink, and it just looks like really gaudy. Um, so I only put that on like before I go to bed. So no one can see it. <laughs> um, the champagne was a little bit better, but that one was really shimmery too, comparable to this. Um, but I really like the texture of these like a lot better than just the plain lip balms from Burt's Bees. Um, it's a little bit um, lighter weight and it has that peppermint um, taste to it. If you don't like that, then you probably wouldn't like these. Um, and yeah, it's just like nice and light. And this Radiance is really nice because it's just like, it's basically just a chapstick with a really pretty sheen to it. Let me see if I can show you guys. It's like really subtle and really natural looking. You can't even see it, but um, I had this on the other day. <laughs> um, my friend Alice is probably gonna watch this and she's gonna laugh. But I had no makeup on kind of looking like a hot mess and um, we went to like go get lunch or whatever and I just had this on and I don't think I even had anything else on and our server was like are you wearing any makeup because you just have this natural beauty to you and he was like full-on hitting on me and it was really awkward but I was wearing this so maybe it was the 